fear is the basis for us doing a lot of crap and a lot of shit in this world and was also trying to make comparison like you know give an example sort of about Adam and Eve and all of that and when God came in and all and Adam said I was afraid God asked Adam where are you and Adam said I was afraid and it was because he had made contact with the enemy with the devil that was why fear had crept in because there was no fear before as a matter of fact Adam did a lot of things Adam you know rode with the animals and all of that he named them everything and there was no fear but all of a sudden fear had crept in because he had made contact with the enemy and it was you know quite an interesting read. as a matter of fact I didn't finish reading it but there was something that was fascinating that occurred to me while I was reading it and I found out that actually it's not fear that the enemy comes to us with it is the feeling of inadequacy and it's that feeling of inadequacy that leads to fear let me explain so what did the serpent tell Eve if you eat this fruit you will be like God first of all Eve didn't know that she was already like God because it had been said in the earlier chapters and verses that God said to you know the remaining people the remaining personalities in the Godhead let us make man in our own image and after our superscription after our likeness that they will be like us they will walk like us they will talk like us they would have the same authority the same shape the same form the same mind the same heart the same spirit they would be like us and so the enemy capitalized on what Eve didn't know her ignorance on who she was because first of all she was already like God and the enemy said if you eat this fruit you'll be like God the reason why God said you shouldn't eat out of this fruit is because he doesn't want you to be like him he doesn't want you to see the way he sees he doesn't want you to act the way he acts but that was not true Eve was already like God and so he capitalizes on the fact that we don't know who we are the fact that we're ignorant of who we are and what we are and what we carry on our inside he capitalizes on it and that was it Eve wanted to be like God and so that means that there was already something inside of her that he was appealing to and that was that feeling of inadequacy that feeling of not being enough and now the truth is I don't know who or what Eve would have tried to compare herself to? Would she have tried to compare herself to her husband? Would she have tried herself to compare herself to God? Would she have tried to compare herself to the ostrich or the zebra or the lioness or whatever it is? I don't know because there were no other human beings apart from her and her husband. So I don't know. I have no idea who Eve would have tried to compare herself to to feel like, oh, I don't have this and this person or this thing has this, meaning I'm lacking, meaning I'm inadequate, meaning that I'm not enough, I'm not good enough, meaning, you know, all of that. And that was what the the enemy was able to capitalize on, the fact that she felt that she was not enough. She felt that she was inadequate because if she knew who she was, first of all, the fact that she was already like God, if she knew who she was that she was God on earth that was one secondly knowing who you are and being comfortable with it and being cool like you know what I'm not like you and that's cool I respect your your um, your your distinctness your difference and everything that makes you you and I expect that you would do the same to me but even if you don't that's cool that's okay I am who I am and nothing is going to change it and I love me the way I am so um I think that was really it that was really it because if she had known who she was she wasn't ignorant of who she was if she had known who she was and she was comfortable with who she was she knew that she was enough she knew that she didn't have to meet up she didn't have to measure up she didn't have to try to be like this or try to be like that she wasn't keeping up with the Joneses if that was all in place and then there was absolutely no way that the enemy would have found a loophole to um, access her 